Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we have a list of top 10 anime where the main character goes berserk when his friends or lover gets hurt. If you enjoy the video, don't forget to leave a like and if you are new, please subscribe to our channel. So without any further delay, let's begin. Number 10. Cerberus Sword and magic rule in the continent of Gunan. Also residing there is the feared evil dragon Dagonzord, an unstoppable force that leaves nothing but scorched land and destruction wherever he goes. Hero's parents joined other sorcerers in a magic ritual 10 years ago in an attempt to seal Dagonzord, but failed when someone interfered. After being rescued by Gyu, young Hero set out to learn swordsmanship so that he could avenge his parents. Hmm? Number 9. UQ Holder Tota Konoe is an ordinary boy raised in a small rural town. His mundane life suddenly changes when his mentor Catherine McDowell reveals herself to be a vampire. After saving Tota from a mortal wound, she causes him to become immortal as well. Already yearning to explore the world, young Toda finally puts his dream to ascend to the top of a tower that leads to outer space into realization. Along the way, he finds a secret society filled with immortals just like human called UQ Holders, gaining new comrades and mentorship along the way. Toda embarks on his own unique magical adventure. <laughs> Number 8. Twin Star Exorcist Rokuro Imado is a young boy who used to be a powerful aspiring exorcist before a tragic incident left his friends dead and made him abandon the profession. One day, he has a fateful encounter with Binyo Adashino, a girl around his age and a well-known exorcist from the East. According to a prophecy, Rokuro and Binyo are the twin star exorcists and are destined to marry and have a child known as the Miko, which will be the ultimate exorcist, capable of cleaning all evil spirits from the world and ending the war that has lasted over a millennium. <laughs> Number 7. Grimvar of Zero It is the year 526 of the liturgical calendar, riches and their sorcery are notorious throughout the land. Though knowledge of the existence of magic remains elusive, a half-man, half-beast mercenary is kind scorned by the populace dreams day and night of becoming a human. However, his faithful encounter one day with a witch by the name of Zero turns his dream into reality. She offers to turn him human if he will escort her as her god on her search for a magical tome, one that possessed powerful knowledge which could wreak havoc in the wrong hands. The two begin their travels with the agreement binding them together with a mercenary serving as Zero's protector, though he despises her kind. Oh. Oh. No, no. What Number 6. Children of the Whales The story focuses on a boy called Takuro who lives on a giant vessel called the Mud Whale that drifts over the Sea of the Sand. In the Mud Whale, society is divided into two kinds of people, the marked, who can move objects with their minds using a strange power called Taimia at the expense of shortened lifespans, and the unmarked people who lack Taimia but enjoy longer lifespans. Takuro and his friends have never seen anyone from the outside world and they spend their days yearning to explore and learn about it. In year 93 of the vessel's exile, the mud veil encounters a lonely island and Chakura finds a girl inside, starting an adventure that changes the lives of everyone. Number 5. Beatless 
With the introduction of an ultra-advanced AI that surpasses human intelligence, beings that mankind is yet to fully comprehend made from materials far too advanced for human technology begin coming to being. Lashia and Hay equipped with a black coffin-shaped device is one of these. In boy meet girl fashion, 17-year-old Arado Ento has a faithful encounter with the artificial Lashia. Number 4. Devil's Line Vampire walks among society, existing as part of its underbelly. They do not require blood to survive, but extreme emotions can immensely increase their bloodlust, turning them into uncontrollable monsters. Sukasa, a 22-year-old university student, learns of the existence of vampires when her longtime friend reveals himself to be one of them after a tense confrontation with Yuki Anzai, a human and vampire hybrid. Her friend is arrested and Tsukasa soon finds herself drawn to Anzai, who reluctantly reciprocates her feelings. However, this unconventional romance may prove too difficult to maintain as Anzai struggles to contain the part of him that wishes to devour Tsukasa. Number 3. World End The fleeting and sad story about little girls known as fairy weapons and associate hero that survived. This is the world after it was attacked by unidentified monsters known as beasts and many of the species in the world, including humans, had been destroyed. The species that had managed to survive left the ground and were living on a floating island. Villain Kamesh wakes up above the clouds 500 years later and couldn't protect the ones who he wanted to protect. Actually, he was living in despair because he was the only survivor. Number 2. The Devil is a Part-Timer the demon lord Satan seeks to conquer the world of anti Islam by annexing its four continents with the help of his demon general, Elsiel. After being confronted by the hero Amelia and her companions, Satan and Elsiel escape the world of anti Islam through a gate to modern Tokyo, Japan. However, due to the lack of magic in the modern contemporary world, both Satan and Elsiel change the form of representing what they would look like if they were humans. In order to survive, Satan takes a part-time job in a fast food restaurant named McRonald. One day, Satan, who now goes by Sadao Mao, meets a girl who is actually Amelia in the form of Emi Yusa. The story then unfolds and explores the personality of each of the characters and their moral values. <laughs> Number 1. Guilty Crown Shu's entire world was shattered after a meteorite crashed into Japan, unleashing the lethal apocalypse virus. The chaos and anarchy born of the outbreak caused Shu, his family, and reduced him to a timid, fearful shell of boy he once been. His life took another unexpected turn after a chance encounter with the stunning pop star Inori. This mysterious beauty introduced Shu to the king's right hand, a genetic mutation nut that allowed him to reach into hearts of mortals and turn them into weapons. Shu finds himself caught in the crossfire between those who desperately seeks his newfound strength. On one side lurks a clandestine government agency and on the other hand Inori and a spirited band of rebels known as Funeral Parlor. The choice is Shu's to make and the world is his to change. That's it for today's video. I hope you like it and please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. If you are new, remember to hit the notification button for any more upcoming videos.